Yes, good morning. Well, they are saying that B117 could become the predominant form of COVID in the U.S. by March. Their concern is that it can spread more easily, impact more people. But they're also saying that this vaccine that's out should be just as effective as the original COVID-19. What is the characteristics? How did the virus change? Not in itself, but also when it infects us, the human beings. How do we react to it? Can we fight it off well, or are we going to have worse outcomes? All questions and concerns, Dr. Trini Matthew, an infectious disease physician at Beaumont, says health officials are investigating about the COVID-19 variant B117. That was initially identified in UK, and we knew it was present sometime in September. It was only a matter of time. We would find it in the U.S. And it's in Washtenaw County. In fact, as of this weekend and for the next two weeks, the state shut down the sports programs at the University of Michigan to prevent its spread. Several affiliated with the athletic programs have tested positive for the new variant. It's not surprising that it's here, and it doesn't necessarily change the actions that you or I or anybody else should be doing right now. Susan Cerniglia is with the Washtenaw County Health Department, which issued an alert after the first five cases were identified in the Ann Arbor area. She says the Michigan Department of Health and Human Services under the leadership of a new director, is being strategic and proactive to keep the public as healthy as possible. We expect the um, demand for testing will increase. And as the vaccine rollout continues, health officials say to continue those precautions as we've been reporting, hand washing, social distancing, and wearing a mask. Reporting live this morning, Darren Cunningham, 7 Action News.